Hey guys, sorry for the extremely long time in between videos. It has just been crazy busy around here. <laughs> birth and like labor and delivery, birth, well birth was fine, but labor and delivery and after did not go quite as planned. I had a lot of things go on that I did not want going on for my labor and delivery, but it was for the safety of our baby, so I did it, obviously. I did uh, only have to push for an hour, and she, Lily Akins, was born on August 15, 2016. She was 6 pounds, 14 ounces, and 18 and a half inches long. I am absolutely in love with her. Unfortunately, she had to go straight to the NICU because of breathing problems. From there, we found out that Lily has trisomy 21, which is Down syndrome. Uh, we also found out that, unfortunately, she has a heart condition where she has four holes in her heart. So, after two months at the NICU where she was born, we transferred her to a children's where we finally decided that to get her home where she can grow and be much happier, we had to have surgery to do a G-tube to help her eat and feed um, because she can't always eat from a bottle um, the amount that she needs to stay healthy. So we got the G-tube in so that we could come home and now we're almost three months old. <laughs> So we have been in the hospital for a very, very long time, but I am just glad that we are finally home. It's not quite the way we had planned for our lives to go with the medical issues, but I have a baby here on earth who is alive and she's absolutely gorgeous. So I would like you guys to meet, <laughs> she's been talking away, my beautiful angel, Lily. Say hello, Lily. Say hello. Hey. <laughs> Can you say hello? Of course she stops talking when the camera gets on. She does this a lot. It's like she's camera shy or something. <laughs> I love you. So, we have been home for only a couple of weeks. We are totally and completely enjoying our time with our sweet little girl. Um... There's a lot of stuff I did not vlog about, and so you guys missed out, and I completely apologize. But I will have, I do have to say that it has been an emotional roller coaster. Um, I've had to quit pumping because her medical needs have just become a little too much for me to try and take care of her and pump at the same time. I do have a pretty big stash, so she'll still get to have breast milk for a little while. Um, then eventually we'll have to switch to formula. That was not an easy choice at all. I did not want to have to do formula. Like, it is absolutely not what I wanted for her. I wanted her to have the best, the best stuff. But, unfortunately, the best stuff does not come easy. So... We will eventually have to switch to other good stuff. Might not be quite as good as the best stuff, but it's still good. It's still healthy and will help her grow. And that's what's mat. And that is what matters. <laughs> She's just like hanging out. Looking at me. <laughs> She is a fantastic baby. She pretty much sleeps through the night, uh, which I still have to get up every three hours to feed her through her feeding pump, which is through her G-tube, which is um, a little thing in her stomach. 
But other than that, she does actually sleep through the night. And, yeah. We will get better at posting videos so that you guys can keep along with us in our adventures. Um, I'll get much better at that, I promise. So that you guys can hang out with us more and see what our life is like. Because it is certainly an interesting life. Yes. <laughs> All right. I just wanted to let you guys know that we're home and we're okay and, you know, that I do still try to plan on, I am going to try to plan, goodness, you guys, I'm so sorry, my brain's, brain, I, I get no sleep, so, <laughs> but, um, I do plan on trying to make more videos, like, I'll try to keep making them, uh, because who wouldn't want to see that beautiful face all the time? <laughs> But, alright you guys, I hope God blesses y'all and have a good day. Bye.